What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Barry Tone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys how to basically change the settings on the Zenny emulator. If you want to go by changing the FPS, V-Sync, enable V-Sync, change the resolution, mess around with the GPU settings and CPU settings. And I'm, in today's video, I'm basically going to showcase you that. But before we get started this video, please make sure guys you like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's get it. Now, when you guys go on the Xenia emulator, you don't see much. As you guys can see, there's basically no settings you can mess around. First thing you usually think when you see CPU and GPU settings, you expect more, like you change the resolutions and do different things, but this is not the case with the Xenia emulator. There's not much you can do, but you guys didn't know, you guys may or may not know this, but you guys can actually change the settings. So I'm gonna close this real quick. But before you guys do that, I advise you guys to get Notepad++ because it's very useful for this situation because it helps you read the settings much more better when you're about to open a certain section inside the Xenia emulator. So when you used to go to Xenia.config, it, it might be something um, different, but it's gonna be something similar to this. Uh, you're gonna left click, you're gonna edit with Notepad++. Plus Plus. I don't know why that popped up, but I said okay to it, but <laughs> it just popped up. All right, so as you guys see here, this is a Xenia um, configuration settings, aka this is where you change the settings. So this is where you see your CPU, your actual CPU, by the way, where you can um, change certain settings. Your D, your D3, D12, which is very important when you're um, that's wrong with Xbox emulation. Your GPU. Um, VSync, which is very important emulation. Your memory, storage, and UI, Vulkan, Vulkan settings. Uh, as you guys see right here, Vulkan is disabled due to the fact that it's more um, recommended to use D3, D12 on your um, Zenia emulator, and I think um, if I'm not mistaken, Vulcan is kind of in beta stage right now. This whole this whole emulator is still in beta stage, but I think Vulcan's is not at the point that it's playable for most games, as you guys can see. Now, like say for example, if you guys want to mess around with a resolution, there's Control Control F, type in resolution or something like that. I I'm, I might be spelling this wrong. <laughs> yep, of course I spelled it wrong. All right. <laughs> All right, so find next. As you guys can see, this is where you basically change your resolution scale and there's different ways you can basically change the settings. It goes by, some some things go by number base. It goes all the way to three and it goes by true or false. True means it's enabled and false means you wanna disable it. It's pretty straightforward. And most things go by number and true and false. All right, so that's, that's where you basically change the resolution and it explains how this um, system basically works. We're trying to change the resolution on there here. And that's basically pretty much it. Um, this is basically the place you go to change your settings on the Zenny emulator. Um, it's pretty weird how it's not straightforward as the most emulators are, but at least they have that option available where you can change your um, settings because I feel like the, the Xenia team feel like the default settings is the best settings um, to each his own. You may think the default settings is the best for all games, you may not. But this is just another alternative you guys can use basically basically just change the settings to get more enhancements out of your game and you want to reduce some things um, when you're game playing stuff, you can also go over here. So that's basically about it. If you guys enjoyed this video or find this video any help at all, feel free to leave a like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. And yeah, guys, this is your boy Brace. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.